What's the crack lads? Welcome back to the channel and welcome to another What's Coming Monday player video. So we're going to be taking a look at what is coming Monday and obviously taking a look at the database here because it has been updated. So we do have an English League Selection Attackers Pack which will be coming on the 30th of September. You have Savio or Savino who's in there. You have Alexander Isaac, you have Danny Welbeck. You have all the players that you see here. Armstrong is there, Iwobi. And of course you have the new boy for uh, Chelsea as well. Um, there's a couple of nice players in here, but again, these are not really ever the big kind of draw, right? The big draw is usually the legends that these come with, right? Now, these have been for here the last couple of weeks, a couple of these legends here, and it looks like that we will be getting these boys here. So you have Eric Cantona that has been updated. You also have Michael Owen, and of course, we do have Thomas Rozicki there as well. Now, there is a couple of other players that have not yet been released, such as Berbatov, who's there. He's not going to be part of this Manchester United pack. I know a few people were asking me about that, but it looks like that these are the players that are going to be added here. So it looks like it's going to be a momentum dribbling Eric Cantona. Um, and I do feel that Cantona could be an interesting one, this this one, right? This this kind of pack. Michael Owen as well. We're going to take a look at his stats there as well in a second. And of course, Thomas Rizicki, right? So we're going to start with King Eric. Obviously, you know, and just an unbelievable player for Manchester United. This is just kind of a brief look at him. Now, we don't know how many levels he's going to have, but it's safe to assume he'll definitely have at least 30. If not 34, he'll definitely have about 31, right? And even with this, you have some really nice player skills here. And of course, you do have that momentum dribble, and that's going to be there as well. But the rest of his skills are really, really nice. Double touch, long range shooting, first time shot, one touch pass, true passing, outside curler, momentum dribbling. Double touches there as well. You give him soul control and uh, flip flap. You're going to turn him very, very silky indeed. But we're going to be focused more on his build today, right? So as a deep line forward here, we're going to just go and choose the champs, right? Um, and we're going to show that manager skill boost here, which is going to give you a plus three or a plus four to certain stats, depending on how high the manager is going to go, right? And this is with his booster as well. So his striker's instinct plus two booster is going to be activated with the champs here which means he's going to be getting a plus four to ball control or else a plus uh, three or two to kick and power depending on his levels here, right? And obviously, if you go up one, we're going to get a plus four to that and the way that it tracks, as you see with the stats here. So just giving a brief look at his card here, right? We are going to be able to get probably around 90 uh, with that. The passing, his passing is actually going to go to 85 in though. He's a deep line forward. The rest of his stats look pretty decent for dribbling. He finally gets a good dribbling card. So we're going to be able to have 90 in all of these while still having what I think is going to be a very, very key build to this card is going to be his dexterity. Now, this is with 31 levels, right? We are kind of looking to kind of have him kind of as a unique player. I don't think we're going to have that attacking awareness as you know big as it needs to be. Also, we will be able to give him an extra booster. So we could kind of cap him there and obviously give him one into acceleration and balance to have that at 85. And of course, we could just tone up and tweak up his physical contact as well. It's it's looking like a very decent card, lads, honestly. It's looking like an exceptionally good card for a deep line forward. And even at that, we don't really need passing into that range. And also, of course, we could give an extra one here to lower body. And that's, you know, that's just saying that he's at 31 levels. You know what I mean? He might have 34 levels or even 33. It depends. That will be finalized when it comes out. I mean, if he has 34 levels... He's going to be insane. Honestly, man, you're going to have a card that is going to be absolutely insane with 34 levels and a really, really good meta version of Cantona. But again, it is only if he does have all of those levels, right? Michael Owen, again, we've got 31 levels here. We'll just give a quick max here with the manager boost. We've gone for Southgate with this one with his booster striker's instinct. And I think if you're looking at this guy again, it is looking like he could be a meta man as well, right? Now, this is obviously a lot into finishing. We won't need to go that hard up into the finishing. Even if we max it at 95, which I think is overkill for a card like this, you'll still be able to get the dribbling fairly nice. I mean, you're not going to get it into the 90 zone with all of these if you want the finishing at 95. But I think one trick that could potentially work really nice for Michael Owen would be if you tone down his, his uh, balance just to about that mark there you're still going to have 92 with the offensive awareness you're still going to have 90 with the balance and 95 acceleration but if you go this route with him you'll also be able to get his dribbling up as high as you possibly want it and of course we can pop one or two more into this which is going to give us a 90 speed with a different manager with 95 acceleration 90 balance and of course the stamina is not going to be needed too much and that's bearing in mind lads you don't literally you won't need this finishing with him you will be able to kind of get him up to a little bit more if you want to go that route with him. 
it just depends on how you want to train him and of course you can pop in a few into aerial strength to get that jump to 81 or else just have no aerial strength and just be able to train him up even more uh in depth you know with the finishing or whatever if you want to go 95 finishing so it's a very interesting card he's definitely going to be kind of meta as well i think and then of course we have thomas rosicki just to round it off right so the player stats here his player skills he's going to have some nice player skills there as well um double touch dribbling is going to be a little bit too much there always with these double boosters boys you don't need to worry too much about it's like with michael owen right you can actually restrict one of these shooting if you want to get it to 95 and give him the booster plus one and then you'll have 95 finishing you'll be able to max out something else and you'll still save three points or the same with the dexterity you know it depends on how you want to actually build the cars but there's a lot of different ways you can build them there is the skills for own is there as well which looks very very nice including that very high weak foot accuracy but this riziki lads could be quite tasty i mean apart from you know the dribbling once you have the dribbling at 90 for all of it you can actually pop in a lot more into this than you would you would naturally assume uh, is going to happen aerial strength you don't even need to mess with that but you can still get 90 speed 90 balance and of course get that or 90 acceleration i should say um and yeah there's going to be some interesting cards i think in this obviously the big one with uh Rosicky here is going to be his low pass as a creative playmaker here it is going to be an interesting card right so that is it boys that is it for your look forward ahead to monday we will be back with a review of these boys i think michael owen we already have a version of michael owen so it's going to be probably a, a pass for me but let me know what you guys think and i will talk to you in a little bit